Hi everyone. Um, I wanted to make this video before my battery dies. Hopefully um, it's not going to be too long. Um, but this is a very exciting um, topic that I thought about maybe filming, but I know it's not going to be everyone's cup of tea. Um, this is going to be for girls and women. <laughs> Um, and men who love skincare and who enjoy taking care of their um, skin. I uh, thought about doing like a beauty re review of Asian products because I've been using uh, Korean and Japanese uh, cosmetics for uh, two or three years now and um, I had this opportunity to order online and uh, they shipped to my country so this is this was great for me. I was really excited and I tried um, a couple of brands, including Etude House, Misha, um, of course, Shiseido, and um, there are new brands coming up um, every every month. And in my country now, Korean cosmetics is mainstream. It's more popular than it was before. But I remember that I ordered online their masks and their... Um, they're like small sample packages so for me that was a big thing and um, I was just impressed with the ingredients and with the packaging with the design the smells the ingredients everything is really really different than um, European cosmetic and and just Western um, Western brands and this was very exciting to me so I wanted to try and I wanted to share with you something that I received um, I waited for it because of this pandemic situation but I finally got it I'm not gonna say the website where I ordered it from but I'm sure you can find uh, these brands um, pretty much on all um, makeup cosmetics supplements um, websites out there but first I want to show you this very very cute um, box this is a Misha uh, product um, and it's their bestseller kit it's a sample size. I like to buy these smaller ones because they're cheaper and they they just look so cute. Um, so inside, I'm gonna open it up. I haven't... Uh, I tried Misha uh, a BB cream and CC cream before, but I've never tried their skincare. So inside you, inside you get this... Um, so inside you get this uh, very cute uh, foam, cleansing foam. And then this is like the first step. The next step would be the um, intensive moist essence. And then you have this very, very cute looking serum. This is a night repair uh, science activator am ampoule. ampoule. Um, and then uh, you have a super aqua uh, cream. Uh, the secret with this... Um, line is that it's made out of snail secretion um, it contains snail secretion in some form the whole the whole box is basically time revolution so that means that it's anti-aging I suppose and it has uh, yeah uh, a snail ferment filtrate and then it has some bacteria that are basically good for your skin like lactic acid as well, B3, um, f a lot of like plant extracts, a lot of oils. So if you see, like, if you buy Lancome or like L'Oreal or other uh, Western brands, the, the ingredients list is not this long, but here in Korean brands and Japanese brands, you have like a whole section of just the ingredients, which uh, means that their products are kind of more complex and they never failed me basically I didn't have um, I have a sensitive skin I would say so I never had any bad experience with uh, Korean products um, that they didn't suit me or that they caused me allergy um, and Japanese products as well so um, she said it was really a premium brand but it's a little bit more expensive so that that's why I choose Korean brands more often uh, but that doesn't mean that I don't like Japanese. Um, Japanese are really, really um, premium. That's what I can say. And I really wish in the future maybe um, there will be more stores in Europe and we can buy more like sample size products and we can enjoy uh, to try their products more. Okay, the next box, it's, um, 
it's a full box of products um, it's called K Beauty um, and inside uh, this is actually a, a, a two two sample packages not just one but I use some of it and um, some of it I have here I saved all the packages so I can show you so firstly we have these masks and the this one is song of the island bright tomorrow renewing mask pack by phycology I'm not gonna even try to pronounce this <laughs> right uh, this is basically a brightening mask and then um, you have like these three steps um, it's a peeling gel it's a mask and then it's a balancing gel uh, this is basically um, made out of natural ingredients and it's supposed to moisturize Pukong Yule is the brand I know this brand is a very old Korean like apothecary brand and they make a lot of interesting products um, so this mask is also nice and then um, a lot of their masks look so medical <laughs> this is a intensive hydrating mask uh, from Medi Heal this is just a plain moisturizing mask I just have these cute cute sample sizes uh, of this for example these two are foaming gels uh, this one is from the brand called Klavu. Uh, I tried this one and it's supposed to brighten your skin. It smells amazing. The texture is very white, very foamy, um, and it doesn't dry out your skin. So this one is very, very good, I would say. And my skin looks, I mean, my complexion is white, uh, but it, it looks brighter with this one. And then this Neogen uh, Micellar Sika Micellar Cleansing Foam also uh, does a good job at cleaning the skin doesn't dry out and it smells nice um, then we have these very cool two sample size creams this one the full size costs around $60 it's very expensive but the small size um, does the job of trying so this is basically the essence of tundra shaga shaga is like a mushroom uh, that you can find in like north forests and it's supposed to nourish and firm your skin it's by a brand called Blithe Blithe and then this brand again this cream full size costs almost the same price uh, from Huxley it's the secret of Sahara anti-gravity cream I just find these names so <laughs> exciting and interesting to try this smells like flowers and it's a very thick cream if you have oily skin this is not gonna work for you it's very good for like mature or very very dry skin uh, this is a pore purifying uh, tea tree clay mask spirulina and tea tree clay mask so it's supposed to brighten and clean your skin and this one is all-in-one egg mellow cream anything that has like an egg uh, essence uh, there is an egging pack in uh, like among Korean uh, products it, it really wor works on your skin it really makes your skin so hydrated so I'm very excited to try this moisturizer uh, this is I think br this brand is available in my country it's the it's skin uh, this is called the GF effector uh, 10 power 10 formula so this is a serum that hydrates your skin it's supposed to um, be used as an addition to the cream or your foundation if you want to lighten up your foundation but the packaging is so cute and the color which is great and also I got this as a as a tester gift it's called uh, rules of mastic mastic um, enhancer recovery balm so this is a very thick medical cream similar to La Roche Posay Sika Plus or something like that so this is uh, supposed to kind of um, protect your skin, skin from like drying out and the last thing I'm gonna mention is this uh, Apothe hair Apothe hair um, again um, this is a tester it's a, a hair mask or hair cream with ginseng it smells really good and it really does a good job at, at the tangling it also works like as a serum for the dry ends but I have a um, few more products from Misha uh, and also I have a, a another cute package like this from Shiseido and I wanted to 
just give a review of these products because I know a lot of people are scared to buy um, and or maybe if you live in Asia and these products are more available to you uh, you can just kind of um, listen to my review and maybe decide if this product is for you or not or anyway I'm just uh, very glad that the new products are coming to the market and that new ways and new new beauty is kind of being accepted worldwide and new ways of taking care of your skin uh, Koreans and Japanese really have this routine of taking care of their skin so they uh, they put products in order they tap their skin that they they don't kind of um, they're not messy with their uh, skin routine and hair care routine so I think we can learn a lot from that uh, here thank you so much for watching uh, see you soon in the next one and yeah take care bye bye